सरकार की तरफ से उन पर दबाव डाला जा रहा था कि ट्विटर अकाउंट को कहीं को ब्लॉक किया जाए अन्यथा उनके ऑफिस में एम्प्लॉय के घर पर रेड डालने की बात को कह रहे हैं ये भी कहा गया कि सरकार की तरफ से कि उनके दफ्तर बंद कर दिए जाएंगे वहीं अब सरकार की तरफ से राजीव चंद्रशेखर जो मंत्री है केंद्रीय मंत्री वो साफ कह रहे हैं कि जब जैक डॉर्सी थे तो ट्विटर जो है वो यहां फॉलो नहीं करती थी एक प्रोपेगेंडा चलाती थी देश के खिलाफ जो है और हमने वही किया जो कानून के दायरे में था और हमने उसी हिसाब से ट्विटर से डील किया क्या कहेंगे Well what Jack Dorsey has said is not surprising at all in the past 9 years after 2014 there has been a systematic erosion of the freedom of speech and expression and civil liberties in the country unfortunately this phenomena is not confined to the central government alone uh certain state governments also Uh, have been equally draconian and authoritarian in the manner in which they st- seek to stifle dissent and uh, try and proscribe alternative voices uh but what jack dorsey is saying uh does not uh, really come as a surprise because i recall that if you would uh, complain to the management of facebook about uh, certain transgressions and aberrations uh, which facebook was indulging in those complaints would go to certain bjp functionaries even before they would reach uh, the management of facebook you know such was the level of infiltration uh, in certain organizations but uh, i would definitely like to uh, add that the media itself is also to blame when certain sections of the media became pet performing poodles because uh, you know to certain interests uh, they obviously you know set a benchmark and standard that if they were dealt in a coercive manner they were willing to toe the line and as uh, uh, the former deputy prime minister mr lal krishna advani had once famously said that when they were asked to bend uh, they decided to crawl and that's been the story of the uh indian media space unfortunately in the past 9 years